بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم الرحمن اليوم من هنا from which city you belong from in Canada Vancouver Vancouver so you miss Vancouver sometimes sometimes you live in a very beautiful place obviously Canada is a very beautiful place you live in Hunza yes I went to Hunza in 1989. Yeah, I have heard that there is new development, but it was beautiful even then. And uh, so you are drinking plenty of gold water. Hunza water. The mountain water. Mountain water, they say. But that time they call it Hunza water. Full of minerals. And they say there is particles of gold in it or blah blah blah. But it was a beautiful place. Very boring road journey, right from Pindi to Gilgit. Unless you're on a bike and then it's exciting. Ah, you went on bike? Ah. So then, then you must have enjoyed it a lot. Yes. We went on a and at the, those time it was Netco. Uh, local bus service, common bus service, and uh, we traveled in it for maybe 18 hours. And then we reached Kilgit after such a long journey. And no tarmac back then. And no? No tarmac back then. Yeah. It's all. All. all the, if you can say not, the, the Karakaram Highway was there. <coughs> and it was continuously the same uh, scenery, mm. barren mountains. It gets better after Gilgit. Yeah, well, after Gilgit it is green. So till Gilgit we were deadly bored. It was just like traveling in a tunnel. And uh, once we reached the Kunza, it was beautiful. It was beautiful then. And uh, then we had a, a plan to go to Skardu later on. But then we, for some or the other, we were nine uh, friends. A gang of nine boys. Mm -hmm. We returned back. I fell ill uh, at Mansara. And Mansara people took very good care of me. I had a very pleasant memory of Mansara. And then we came back. Uh, till Pindi, I got very serious. Rather, I was telling my friends to leave me here and tell my mom that I died there. <laughs> On the railway station, I uh, was not having even. Uh, Part to climb few stairs, yeah. and they were uh, pushing me. They were also <laughs> very sick, but they were telling me, "No, you have to move on." It was uh, very late at night, and uh, we sometimes we recall it that uh, at the Ramkundi railway station, we crossed from one platform to the other platform. Uh, they were almost dragging me. And when we reached on the other side, uh, I was severely dehydrated, severe gastroenteritis. Uh, I was suffering. It was uh, maybe 20 loose balls. And uh, I was thinking that it was the end of my life. The moment we went on that side, there was uh, one, uh, we call it uh, Belana or uh, sugar cane juice. Ganne ki raw wala, subo paanch pahe. और पता नहीं कहाँ से वो चल रही थी और उसने मुझे देखा इन्होंने उसे कहा कि इसको तो बड़े शदीद मोशन लगे हैं I had very severe diarrhea so sugar cane juice is it's a purgative but he said oh no 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 let him lie down over here he was having one cough there and I just fell down over there and he forced me to drink three glasses of sugar cane juice with full of black salt in it and with lemon in it and I don't know it was so energetic immediately I started walking and the train came at that time time 
we started traveling towards Lahore. And with every passing time, I am getting better, better, better. So by the time I reached Lahore, I was sick, but I was in, with good energy. And uh, my friends planned to hide me in one of uh, their home. One of my friends, he kept me there for two days. I. Uh, once I was in a presentable shape, then they <laughs> headed me over to my mom. Yeah, we are back. <laughs> it was a horrible journey that time coming back. So that is uh, one of the haunting memories. Yeah. <laughs> But I do remember Hunza. Stayed there one night, I think. So you were already living in Hunza? Yeah, we've been there two years now. MashaAllah. And you have kids? Uh, just two dogs. Just two dogs only yeah, by kids. the time. But you people are having plan any plans to have kids or no? Let's see. Let's see. Yeah. But for the time we are enjoying Because the Hunza. <laughs> okay, best wishes. So she is going back to Canada. Toronto. Toronto. She is going back to Toronto. You have to get any message or anything. She will take it over there for someone. Just warm. It's very cold right now. <laughs> <laughs>